Question 11. Greg sells car insurance and home insurance. The table shows the costs of these insurances. Each month, Greg earns £530 basic pay, 5% the cost of all the car insurance he sells, and 10% the cost of all the home insurance he sells. In May, Greg sold six car insurances and four home insurances. Work out the total amount of money Greg earned in May. Now you're given two pages to work this out, but if you're very careful and organise your work well, you can probably fit it all in this space at the bottom. So we know he automatically gets £530. So firstly, to work out how much he gets from the car insurance, we need to know what the cost of all the car insurance was. So let's start off with the car insurance. Now he sells six car insurances, each one is £200. I would use the second page to show any form of calculations that you need. In this case, 6 times 200 is 1,200. So that's the cost of the car insurance, but he only gets 5% of this. So 10% of the car insurance is when you divide by 10, so we would end up with £120. 5% is just half of that value. So half of 120 is £60. So Greg gets £60 from the car insurance. Next is the same idea but with home insurance instead. He sells four home insurances, so that's four lots of £350. Four times 350 is 1,400. So this time he gets 10%. So to find 10% of a number, we divide by 10, which means he gets £140 from the home insurance. So to find out how much money he earns in May, Greg will earn his £530 basic pay. He gets £140 from the home insurance and £60 from car insurance. By adding those three values together, we end up with 0, 3, 7. So he makes £730 in the month of May.